Dearly beloved, we are here gathered in the name of God to witness and proclaim the joining together of this man and this woman in holy matrimony. The one of marriage was established by God at creation and of our Lord Jesus Christ himself adorned this manner of life by his presence and first miracle at the wedding at Cana of Galilee. The union of a man and a woman in heart, body, and mind is intended by God for their mutual joy, for the help and comfort given one another in prosperity and adversity, and when it is God's will for the procreation of children and their nurture in the knowledge and love of the Lord. Therefore, marriage is not to be entered into an advisedly or lightly, but reverently, deliberately, and in accord with the purposes for which it was instituted by God. Reading from the first letter of St. Paul to the Corinthians, If I speak in the tongues of men and angels, but have not love, I am as a noisy as a gong or a clanging cymbal. Love is patient and kind. Love does not insist on its own way. Love never ends. The lighting of the candles symbolizes the beginning of a new life together for Shota and Jerez. Jesus said to his disciples, As the Father has loved me, so I have loved you. Remain in my love. This is my commandment. Love one another as I have loved you. Brothers and sisters,